Lights, Camera, Action, Runway. Our U Atelier hosted their first annual diversity fashion show on Sunday, and students came out to see what it was all about. I want to see like kind of what fashion people are sporting around campus, or like what kind of accessories they're wearing. Uh, so my sister is actually one of the models. We're just here to support her. I thought it'd be interesting. Like I've never heard like a fashion diversity show. Style wasn't the only purpose of the event as diversity took center stage. Our show aimed to kind of show case like diversity in the fashion industry, not through models but also clothing and music. Diversity seemed to draw each model into volunteering on RU Atelier's runway, giving them each a purpose for strutting down the runway. Being from like an Indian um, background and seeing that was incredible and seeing so many people try them on, um, I think it's like really like getting diverse, but like everyone looks great in it, I think that was good. I really like their idea for like to make the show about diversity and that concept was very important. So I like that combination. Honestly, I really love the idea of diversity in fashion. I feel like a lot of models are told they have to be super tall, super like conventionally attractive, whatever that means, <laughs> to be a model. So, I mean, the fact that I could have this opportunity makes me really happy. RU Atelier is donating their proceeds to the National Diversity Council, a tri-state area non-profit organization. We chose that because it really focuses on diverse um, people within the workforce, um, and we really try to show that through like the different processes of our fashion show. The new organization on campus was so appreciative of the help that they got from not only the sponsors and organizers, but also the models who seemed to be happy to be there. It's really just a means of expressing yourself, you know, just like in a very visual way, and it's very personal, So, because it's the clothes that you wear, the clothes that you design. It's pretty zen, in a weird way. Uh, walking down the runway, you really don't think about anything but walking, so it's kind of relaxing in a weird way. In high school, everyone was like dressed a specific way, you had to like fit the norm and here it's like whatever you want to do it's really how you express yourself one thing be from like made in like america the other thing made in africa you put them together boom it's just the way i feel like i can change my attitude like wearing a cute outfit makes me feel cuter <laughs> for those who want to get involved with fashion diversity president zaya janellum says to just go for it it's really first just having a conscious effort to want to do those things if you don't like think about it, it's not going to happen. So it's like, it's first wanting to do it and then um, really pushing to like have that vision. From a day of fashion and diversity, I'm Emily Gibbs reporting live from RU Atelier's fashion show.